Um, so where is it along the base or is it on the whole so downstairs? No, uh, that corner here by the sliding glass door. Yeah. So we this have area here. here opposite the sliding glass door. Right. Underneath the window directly behind you. Okay. Dining room window, same area baseboard. Hmm. See it more over on this corner. It's just a small bit of stain. Yeah. Right here. So I'm trying to think of what's causing all these different spots to have. Yeah. Uh, so it's most likely culprit is cracking along the, the stucco along the exterior that's allowing moisture penetration through the inside. Uh, needs to be sealed and and you can paint over it. Uh, but the biggest thing is sealing it to prevent moisture from coming through. So it could be the exterior stucco that's kind of weak or causing problems, and then as a result, you're having this yep. inside so, issue. So cement, concrete block, the stucco, they're all cementitious materials, means they absorb water. Uh, your exterior paint is really what's gonna stop that from happening. That's why caulking, uh, redoing the paint about every 10 years are all big components of keeping moisture out of the interior of the house. Okay. So the cracks, they stop that from happening. Gotcha. It just allows the moisture to penetrate the room. And then the final location is going to be sliding glass door, front living room, again, both left and right sides. Okay. Right side has recently been painted, yeah. uh, but still elevated moisture levels. Yeah, yeah. And, the, and this is also kind of the same thing? Uh, that's more than likely. Um, that one, they don't have any active moisture in there now, so it could have been previous issue that's since been repaired. So this is dry, but all these have active moisture? Yes. Okay. Gotcha. All right, thank you. Mm -hmm.